figure in the Cuyahoga County corruption probe is going to prison. Former Judge Bridget McCafferty was sentenced late this afternoon. McCafferty will spend 14 months in federal prison, and already, she says, she'll appeal her sentence. News Channel 5 Chief Investigator Ron Regan joins us now. Ron, fill us in. Well, federal prosecutors wanted to throw the book at McCafferty, and they got part of what they wanted, at least. Now, you're going to recall that she was convicted last March on 10 counts of lying to the FBI. A jury at that time found that she did indeed have conversations with former Auditor Frank Russo and former County Commissioner Jimmy DeMora about cases in her courtroom. But when FBI agents questioned her about that, she denied that either one of them ever spoke to her or tried to influence her. Her attorney today said he's going to appeal. It's not obviously a, a pleasant day. Um, we were hoping for... Um, something a little bit less, but uh, we understand the, uh, the judge's role. We're going to appeal the case. Um, we think we have some good issues for the appeal. Now, she could have gotten away with as little as probation to six months, but again, as I mentioned, federal prosecutors wanted to toughen that up, and the judge gave her 14 months in a federal prison in Alderson, West Virginia. And if that sounds familiar to you, that's the same federal prison where Martha Stewart spent her time following her conviction. Uh, she will remain uh, free at least for the next week or so. Our lawyers are going to file an appeal, and then a judge will rule on whether or not she'll report to prison immediately. Reporting live in Akron, I'm Chief Investigator Ron Regan.